Hi all, I will walk you through now chapter 11, the last chapter from the book for the semester and this is on online payment. Okay, so first we will look at the online payment system basics. There are different payment technologies, for example, payment cards, electronic or e-cash, software wallets and smart cards and also there are four ways to purchase items. You can pay by cash, by checks, through credit cards and through debit cards. Okay, now these four ways to purchase items account for more than 90% for all consumer payments in the United States. Payment card can be credit card, visa, master, limited spending, okay. Debit card, it removes sales amount from bank account of card holder. Charge card, like American Express, it has no spending limit. Entire amount is due at the end of billing period. So, Within payment cards, we can talk about credit card, debit card, or charge card. So credit card has limited spending because it has a credit limit. Debit removes sales amount from the you know bank account of the card holder. And charge cards, they have no spending limit, but the entire amount is due at the end of the billing period. Advantages and disadvantages of payment cards. Greatest advantage is worldwide acceptance. Also, there is limited liability for fraudulent use. Disadvantages, sometimes there is an annual fee and also sometimes uh, there is a part transaction fee. What is an open loop system and what is a closed loop system? Open loop, oh, sorry, open loop system is third party processes transaction. So there is an intermediary bank. For example, Visa, MasterCard. Closed loop system, card issuer pays merchants, pays merchants directly. They do not use intermediary bank. For example, American Express and discover card. So American Express discover card they follow closed loop system and open loop system is followed by Visa and MasterCard who have a third party processing their transaction. What is a merchant account? A merchant account is an account set up by an online merchant to process payment cards for internet transactions. What is an e-cash? E-cash is any value storage created by a private entity. Example, PayPal, eCash payment system. It's also known as peer-to-peer -peer payment system, provides a free payment clearing service. Micropayments, internet payment for items costing from a few cents to approximately a dollar. What is software or e-wallets? E-wallets can hold credit card number, e-cash, owner identification, owner contact information and provide that information at an e-commerce site checkout counter. Yahoo Wallet is a service site e-wallet. Microsoft Windows Live ID also includes a service, uh, sorry, a server site e-wallet. Store value card. Store value cards are a smart card with a microchip or a plastic card with a magnetic strip that records the currency balance. And smart cards is a stored value card with a microchip that can store information. A smart card can store 100 times more information than a magnetic strip card.
and this is your chapter 11.